What are filters? Moodle has a number of filters which affect how elements of the course are displayed. This MP3 sound file displays in its own player because the Multimedia Plugins filter has been activated. To see which filters your Moodle administrator has made available, we go to the Administration block, which in this course is on the right, and click the link Filters. This takes us to the Filters setting page, where we see a list of filters. For example, Multimedia Plugins is on, hence we can display our sound files in a player. Display emoticons as images is another example of a filter, and this would make punctuation, such as a colon and a bracket, turn into a smiley face automatically. Glossary auto-linking means that if we had a key term to a glossary and then type that key term somewhere on the course, it would automatically link to its glossary entry. Let's go into a course and add a couple of items to see how these filters work. So I'm going to turn on the editing either by clicking the button top right or scrolling down and clicking the link Turn Editing On in the administration block. And then in the course, in the section Writing, I'm going to click the Configuration icon to get into the Topic Summary. Let's type a sentence which includes two possible filters. So adjectives would link to a glossary entry and the punctuation at the end should turn into a smiley emoticon. If we now save the changes, there we see we have a smiley face and if we hover our cursor over the word adjectives, and click on it, it takes us to the glossary entry which we made in a previous video explaining glossaries.